Physicists believe the universe began with a massive Big Bang around 13.7 billion years ago, a moment that changed the cosmic sky forever. The question remains, what exactly triggered this explosion, and why did it happen in the first place? Scientists have spent years analyzing the universe, trying to solve the mystery behind its dramatic birth. The Big Bang theory remains the most widely accepted explanation, backed by research and satellite imagery. Thousands of scientists have studied this theory using data from space missions and complex calculations. The evidence they collected consistently supported the Big Bang as the primary theory for how our universe came to exist. According to this theory, dark energy is far more common than visible matter in the cosmic framework. This dark energy acts like an anti-gravity force, driving the endless expansion of space. Science keeps evolving as technology improves and helps us explore beyond the visible stars. Old ideas often get challenged by new theories, reshaping how we see the cosmic canvas. Things we once thought were facts have sometimes turned out to be wrong, forcing science to adapt its cosmic lens. Michio Kaku has recommended rethinking the Big Bang theory due to new discoveries from outer space. The James Webb Telescope found 750 galaxies that don't match our previous expectations. These newly discovered galaxies bring a fresh view of the universe's evolution, surprising even veteran astronomers. The James Webb Telescope is reshaping what we know about the cosmos, turning theories upside down. Astronomers are now questioning the standard model, hoping to unlock secrets hidden in deep space. The telescope has captured breathtaking images showing countless galaxies across the cosmic skyline. Each image features galaxies glowing like colorful gems scattered through infinite darkness. The beauty of these images amazes the public, but for scientists, they signal deep challenges to old beliefs. They expected galaxies to look a certain way, but these new ones don't follow previous models. Many of them appear much smaller than predicted, shaking what we thought about the universe's youth. These galaxies' small size and age go against earlier ideas about the early cosmic landscape. Their discovery has caused real concern among cosmologists, with some even calling it a panic in journals. These galaxies simply don't match predictions made by the traditional Big Bang framework. If true, these findings might revolutionize our understanding of the universe's beginning. For decades, the Big Bang has been our go-to explanation, suggesting everything started from one point. But now the James Webb Telescope challenges that, showing galaxies that are too smooth and too numerous. Unlike Hubble's images, James Webb shows galaxies two to three times smaller than what we expected to see. The Big Bang model says things farther away should appear larger due to optical effects. But these observations don't follow that rule, causing confusion in scientific circles. The galaxies are also too orderly, lacking the messy structure usually seen in young galaxies. Instead of irregular shapes, they show smoothness, surprising astronomers who expected more chaos. These findings don't match the predicted timeline of galaxy formation under the Big Bang model. If the model were right, early galaxies should appear chaotic in ancient photons. The Big Bang says all matter came from a single, incredibly dense singularity, a hot cosmic point. Einstein's relativity equations support such a singularity where gravity and pressure were extreme. All mass and energy were packed into a space tinier than a single atom. The pressure inside the singularity was beyond anything today's instruments can even imagine. Temperatures were unimaginably high, enough to spark the beginning of the entire universe. From that singularity, the universe expanded rapidly into the vast void we now observe. This early growth phase is called cosmic inflation, where space stretched at insane speeds. During this period, the universe expanded faster than the speed of light, reshaping the cosmic layout. This expansion helped scatter matter, influencing how galaxies formed across the cosmos. Once inflation slowed, the universe kept growing at a steady and measurable pace. This growth was confirmed by scientists using light from faraway galaxies as their measurement tool. By studying redshift, they observed how light stretches as space expands. The redshift causes distant galaxies to appear as if they're moving away, like echoes in the cosmic mirror. Initially, matter was crammed into a tiny volume, 
making atomic formation impossible in those early moments. Then particles like protons, neutrons, and electrons started forming, changing everything in space's fabric. This early particle formation is called nucleosynthesis, crucial to creating our universe's foundation. Scientists had expected early galaxies to be chaotic due to frequent cosmic collisions. Instead, James Webb revealed galaxies with highly structured and organized shapes. The existence of spiral galaxies this early is shocking, challenging older galaxy growth assumptions. If these galaxies didn't merge, they might have always been large, not formed by combining smaller pieces. This counters the idea that small galaxies merged over time to become the ones we see in today's cosmic landscape. If they were never small, then our model of galaxy formation may need updating and fresh thinking. The optical illusions expected from an expanding universe, like stretched appearances, aren't showing in the images. Galaxies don't look distorted as they should, questioning key assumptions in space theories. Their age and placement in the universe don't fit the expected timeline from the standard Big Bang view. The infrared filters of the James Webb telescope allow sharper views of faraway objects. By analyzing these filtered colors, scientists estimate galaxy ages more accurately than ever before. These age results are surprising and don't match previous evolutionary models. This data might force scientists to create new theories that explain cosmic growth in a different light. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.